All right, y'all. So I wanted to show you, there are more of those eggs that have popped up since yesterday. Look, there's one right there. There's some right there. And then there's the actual mushroom. Ooh, sorry, I'm shaking. I'm trying to keep my camera from getting wet. It's raining. It's been raining all day. But that's the actual mushroom. It kind of looks like a phallic symbol, right? Look, there's some more right here. You see those? Some right here. Yeah, they're all over. Look, that one busted open. So it's about to release the, the um, mushroom. This one's busted open too. Oh, my phone's getting wet. But you see how they're all kind of like all around in this grassy area? This one right there. Look at that. So that's what they're going to turn into. So, and this was not here yesterday. They, they grow fast. Look, there's some more over here. This is crazy. I'm like really tripping over these. There's another great big one and some more grass. There's another one. This is crazy. Look, there's another one in here. That one's busted open too. That's crazy, because I've seen them before now that I think about it, but I thought they were just rocks. Look, here's some more. Oh look, there's one that's busted open. That is crazy. All right, now I'm just like walking along my yard. I just cut this grass, by the way. Let's see. So is this a rock or is it one of those eggs? I think it's one of the eggs. There's another one right there. Oh, now see, once you see them, you don't miss them. There's some more coming up right here. Wow. The ones I dug up from yesterday. And look, one's busted open. That's crazy. I know I need more adjectives to describe that. Here's some more smaller ones. But they're everywhere. But you see this right here? This is actually a rock. So that's why I was thinking they were rocks too. Our rocks look like potatoes here. And yet another big one. That one's busted open too. There's some right here. Oh my goodness, it's like they're everywhere now. On this large mushroom too. Wonder what that is.
All right, so I found out what those strange egg-shaped objects were in my yard. Um, they're actually called uh, stank horn eggs, and they are considered edible. Um, and they also say that they're really good to have in your yard because it improves the soil. Um, so they say, you know, they stink really bad, but if you can put up with the stink, you know, don't touch them. Let them do what they do. Um, so Nancy's Arts 11, you were right. It is a type of mushroom. And I'm not going to try them because, you know, we have sprayed different chemicals in that corner of the yard. And so I don't definitely don't want to eat anything from that area um, people say it tastes like radish oops should have turned that off um, yeah so people say it tastes like radishes um, so there you have it it's also called alien eggs or witches eggs and there are a lot of different legends that go on about them if you want to call them legends or I don't know what you want to call it or legends they're considered to be magical and I'm going to tell you when I first saw them in the yard I was like what the heck um, because I've seen them before but I always considered them like I thought they were rocks just kind of surfacing and then I never thought anything about it uh, because it would always be in the fall after like the last time I mow the grass so you know I never really looked at it after that so yeah that's what they are so I also found a channel Jamie Kunka I hope I pronounced his name right he's from Scotland so I'm gonna let you hear a little bit about what he has to say about them when it's in its egg stage you can cut it in half and sort of cut out the white flesh and it's said to be crunchy and radish like so I'm gonna oh sorry I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna cut one open because yesterday I smashed it open my last video Ooh. but I'm gonna cut this open so you can see what it looks like it's actually slimy it's hard to cut open because while the slime And look at that. So people eat this part. Um, they don't eat the slime too much. You see all the slime? But they eat this part. And it I can tell it smells kind of like a radish to me. I can actually smell it. It's making me want to sneeze. <laughs> but it smells like a radish. And that's what people say it tastes like. But I'm not going to be eating it today. But anyway. So... That's what it is. It's also been used in Germany and France as an aphrodisiac, sometimes dried and mixed into spirits or even sausages. So yeah, so that's what it is. You know, it was alarming when I first saw it. Um, but I want to thank you for stopping by Chef Carter's Cooking Corner. Remember to like, subscribe, share, stick around and watch more videos. I even have a video on mushroom hunting. Uh, you can check that one out too. Alright, take care y'all.